Okay, I'm going to go through another example of factoring uh, using the grouping method when there's no greatest common factor. So here I've got 5x squared minus 11x minus 12, and as you can see, there's not a number that will divide 5, negative 11, and negative 12 other than 1. So what we want to do is we want to multiply the 5 and the negative 12 together. So if I multiply those, I'm going to get negative 60. Write that off on the side. Now we want to find all of our factors of negative 60. Alright, so from here on, 60 is not divisible by 8, 60 is not divisible by 9, 60 is divisible by 10, but we already have 10, so these are all of our factors. And if we scan through these really quick, we see that 4 and negative 15 and, uh, negative 4 and 15 and 4 and negative 15 are the pair that we should be looking at right here, and that 4 and negative 15 adds to negative 11, 4, uh, negative 4 and positive 15 add to a positive 11. So since we want a negative 11 like we have here in our problem, we want positive 4 and negative 15 as our pair. So we're going to split up the negative 11x. like so, and we're going to bring down the 5x squared and the negative 12. Okay, now I'm going to put parentheses around my first two terms and my second two terms. Remember, I need a plus sign in between my two parentheses, so this negative from the 15x is going to come inside. So I'm going to have plus and then negative 15x minus 12. From the first parentheses here, we see that we can only divide, um, we can only divide by x here. There's no number that divides both 5 and 4. So we're going to factor out an x, and I should get 5x plus 4 on the inside. With the second parentheses here, I can divide both 15 and 12 by 3, but since both of these are negative, I'm actually going to factor out a negative 3. So I'm going to write minus 3 here, and when I do that, 15 divided by 3 is 5x plus 4, like that. And you see we've got the same thing in both parentheses, so we did this correctly. So we can go ahead and write our answer now. First parentheses is what's the same, 5x plus 4. And second parentheses is what's in front, x minus 3. And this right here is our final answer.